This isn't just another battery upgrade. This is a declaration of independence, silently launched from the heart of America. When Elon Musk responded to a single tweet, he didn't just confirm a rumor. He sparked a revolution. One that has a name now, NC05, a battery that could bury China's dominance, rewrite Tesla's DNA, and power the future of EVs from U.S. soil. From anode to cathode, from range to cost, it's not a tweak, it's a total reset. And the first test subject, the 2026 Model 2. The timing isn't random, it's war. A silent one. Let's dive in. How all new is Tesla's NC05 battery? Tesla's NC05 battery isn't a minor upgrade. It's a full-scale transformation. The name might sound like another version in a long technical line, but NC05 marks the most radical shift Tesla has made in battery design. It stands for Nickel-Based Compact Cell, fifth generation. But here's the twist. It ditches the cylindrical 4680 format entirely. Instead, Tesla moves to a rectangular prism shape. That sounds subtle, but it changes everything. Energy density jumps to 310 watt-hours per kilogram, far beyond the 4680's 260, and leagues ahead of Chinese competitors like CATL or BYD. This improvement translates directly into real-world performance, 300 miles of range in the Model 2 compared to 100 dd in BYD's Seagull. But range is only part of the story. Tesla's dry electrode coating method, refined for NC05, eliminates toxic solvents and reduces production costs by 40%, while also cutting pack assembly time by 30%. The cell design reduces internal resistance by 15%, enabling a full 0.80% charge in under 10 minutes. The architecture is modular, the temperature tolerance extreme, and the efficiency unmatched. From 40 degrees C to 65 degrees, NC Dealer 5 performs where others fail. And with a cycle life reaching 2 million miles, it isn't just a step forward, it's a new starting line. Tesla didn't evolve its battery. It rebuilt it. Quietly, fundamentally, and with the precision of a company aiming to change the world's energy infrastructure from the inside out. How is NC05 a technological threat to BYD? BYD rose to power by leaning heavily on China's battery supply chain. With China producing over 95% of the world's battery-grade graphite, BYD thrived in a system where control meant dominance. But Tesla's NC05 changes the rules. Rather than compete within China's framework, Tesla stepped out of it entirely. With lithium from Piedmont in the US, nickel from Canada and Indonesia, and a groundbreaking partnership with Sela for silicon anodase, Tesla has quietly built an American-led battery ecosystem. Silicon anodes don't just replace graphite, they improve capacity, reduce charging times, and extend battery life. While BYD's LFP batteries take up to 45 minutes to reach 80%, NC Solar 5 hits that mark in under 15. It's not evolution, it's a new direction. Tesla's dry electrode process slashes cost and eliminates toxic solvents. BYD's manufacturing still depends on wet processing and graphite imports. NC05 bypasses both. Tesla didn't challenge BYD's dominance, it rendered it outdated. As Tesla cuts dependency and builds locally, BYD is left defending a supply chain that no longer looks necessary. The real threat isn't just better tech. It's the end of the system that BYD was built for. How appealing is Tesla? Testing the NC05 battery for Model 2. Tesla isn't waiting for the future. It's building it now, quietly, strategically, and cell by cell. The NC05 battery is no longer locked in a lab. It's already being tested inside the upcoming Tesla Model 2. 
That's not a rumor. It's confirmed through supplier activity, factory leaks, and Musk's own cryptic confirmations. This battery is in pilot production, undergoing real-world tests inside Tesla's thermal, structural, and efficiency workflows. And it's being shaped specifically for the $25,000 Model 2, the vehicle meant to dominate the mass EV market. The goal is bold but simple. Reduce cost, maximize range, and qualify for full U.S. tax credits under the Inflation Reduction Act. Tesla is targeting a 90% dry cathode yield by late 2025, aligning perfectly with Model 2's production timeline. Validation builds are expected to start in early 2026, with full-scale rollout later that year. By using NC05, Tesla slashes battery cost, boosts charging speeds, and strengthens its local supply chain, all while making the Model 2 the most accessible high-performance EV ever built. It's not just a new battery in a new car, it's the foundation for Tesla's next big chapter, and it's already underway. Why should traditional automakers be extremely worried? Traditional automakers are still playing catch-up, while Tesla quietly rewrites the rules. Ford, GM, Volkswagen, and Hyundai continue to rely on Chinese technology and foreign supply chains, locking themselves into outdated systems. Ford's battery plant in Michigan, still licensed from China's CATL, GM's supply deals, tied to LG Chem, which sources heavily from China. Meanwhile, Tesla is sprinting ahead with a fully Americanized battery strategy. NC05 is already in pilot production. Dry cathode lines are scaling in Lathrop. And by late 2025, Tesla aims to hit a 90% dry cathode yield, something legacy automakers haven't even begun to chase. This isn't just innovation. It's insulation from tariffs, geopolitical risks, and rising material costs. With NC05, Tesla cuts battery costs by 30%, slashes production time, and qualifies for full U.S. tax credits. Legacy brands, in contrast, are paying more per cell, importing batteries across oceans, and missing out on $7,500 per car in federal subsidies. Tesla now holds the four keys traditional OEMs lack. Speed, scale, subsidy, and supply chain control. That's not a competitive edge. That's a threat to survival. If they don't pivot fast, they won't just lose market share. They'll lose the race altogether. Now first, like always, be sure to hit the like button down below. It helps us out tremendously with the reach of this video. Thank you. Is this the end of China's battery dominance? For years, China's dominance in the battery world seemed untouchable. From raw materials to manufacturing, it controlled every major link. But the rise of NC05 signals something far more disruptive than a new battery. It signals a fracture in that dominance. Tesla has quietly built an alternative ecosystem. Lithium from Nevada, nickel from Canada and Indonesia, silicon anodes from California, and dry electrode lines inside U.S. factories. This isn't a shift. It's a replacement. NC05 doesn't just avoid Chinese materials, it renders them obsolete. No graphite, no cobalt, no dependency. And the numbers speak louder than diplomacy. NC05 charges three times faster, lasts four times longer, and is 30% cheaper to produce. That's not a gentle improvement, that's a knockout punch. While Chinese firms like BYD and Cattle push to optimize legacy tech, Tesla has leapfrogged them with an entirely new platform. And it's not a theory, it's already in production. If NC5 reaches mass scale by 2027, it won't just challenge China's battery dominance, it could end it. What began as a response to a tweet may now be remembered as the day China's battery empire met its match. Not with noise, but with quiet, relentless engineering. Why NC05 is Tesla's ultimate weapon in the EV race? 
NC05 isn't just a better battery. It's Tesla's masterstroke, a quiet weapon designed to shift the balance of the entire EV industry. While others focus on short-term upgrades, Tesla has built a long-term solution that hits every pressure point. Cost, speed, independence, and scalability. At its core, NC05 reflects a complete reset in Tesla's battery strategy. It's lighter, more energy-dense, faster to charge, and radically cheaper to produce. But more importantly, it's fully compatible with U.S. manufacturing incentives and requires zero Chinese supply chain involvement. That gives Tesla a pricing edge no legacy automaker or Chinese competitor can match. The battery's integration into the Model 2 isn't a coincidence. It's a statement. This sub-$25,000 EV, powered by a battery that charges in under 10 minutes and lasts for 2 million miles, is aimed squarely at mass adoption. And Tesla isn't announcing it with fanfare. It's testing it quietly, refining it with precision, and preparing it for global scale. NC05 isn't hype. It's hardware. It's not a reaction. It's a roadmap. And if the plan holds, Tesla won't just lead the EV race. It will own the playbook. While others talk about the future, Tesla is already building it, one NC05 cell at a time. What makes the Model 2 plus NC05 combo a global game changer? The Tesla Model 2 paired with the NC05 battery isn't just another EV release. It's a turning point in automotive history. At under $25,000, this compact electric car will be more affordable than most gas-powered vehicles. And yet, it comes packed with next-gen tech that rivals can't match, starting with the NC05 at its core. This isn't a stripped-down budget model. It's a high-efficiency machine built on Tesla's most advanced engineering. The NC05 gives it 300 miles of range, 10-minute charging, and a lifespan of up to 2 million miles, all while keeping weight and cost dramatically low. No other car in this price range offers anything close. And with U.S. manufacturing and localized materials, the Model 2 will qualify for full government incentives, slashing the real purchase price even further. This is what mass adoption looks like. Not promises, but production-ready solutions. For millions of drivers priced out of EVs, the Model 2 becomes the gateway. For governments pushing sustainability, it's the policy success story. And for Tesla, it's a global assault on legacy car makers and foreign supply chains. Together, Model 2 and NC05 don't just challenge the status quo, they redefine what an electric vehicle can be for the world. This isn't just Tesla's next battery. It's the next chapter in the electric revolution. NC05 marks the moment when dependency gave way to dominance, when affordability met performance, and when quiet innovation began to outpace global empires. The Model 2 won't just carry a new battery. It'll carry an entire strategy built for scale, speed, and sovereignty. And if everything we've uncovered holds true, the age of compromise in EVs may finally be over. The question now isn't if NC05 will change the game, it's when you'll feel it on the road. Until then, stay curious. The future is charging.